Hello everyone, I am M. Allen West of FlashCadabra.com and today I'm going to show you why I think that the new version of Blender 3D is not going to be that great for sculpt mode. Um, if you open up the original version of Blender 3D before these new changes take effect, uh, you'll notice that in the sculpt mode you can clearly tell what each one of these brushes are. However, in the newer version, if you go over into sculpt mode, it's got these generic icons, which seems fine for the default brushes. However, if I was to go in here and to append new brushes from my downloaded brush sets, which would be listed under add-ons, brushes, and it would be in this blend file that I downloaded. If I select all these brushes and I click enter on my keyboard, these brushes will be added to this list and it'll slowly start generating icons for each one of the brushes and I can clearly tell what each brush is and what it does. However, in this newer version of Blender, if I were to go over here and to append the brushes in this one and I select the same exact brushes and press well it's not going to let me do all of them at once so I'm just going to select a couple press enter and if I go over to my list what I have instead of a easy to understand list of icons. I have a set of extremely generic icons where I can't tell what any of these brushes do. Over here I can look at this list and I can clearly tell what every brush does, what they look like at a quick glance. This I have no idea what any of these look like before testing them out. All it is is just very generic looking icons.